okay so first of all i have to select this uh, layer and i'm going to copy the content and we're going back into the web flow so on the left side we have to uh, provide a div block like we did on the previously so in this div block we have to give a text layer so we got this heading okay and then double click to change the content just like that right so if you see in the adobe xd we we are using this a uh, monstrat medium with this kind of color okay so first of all i have to change this arial into the monstrat and select into the medium type and change the color based the hex code that i did here okay so then after that we have uh, to provide another section which called a paragraph so the paragraph has the style with uh, Montserrat like with the 16 uh, font size and the color is a uh, 7c 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 all right so double click to change the content and change the font size 16 and 7c 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 and then change it into the Montserrat and this is supposed to be light okay so it has the line hack which is uh, 26 so we have to give about 26 here and the margin top is about 30 but as you know the heading has already the margin so i think we just give the margin 30 here okay and just like this it's pretty simple right and then we are going next into this a uh, button so below of this paragraph we have to give a button that we called a join match join match okay so if you see properly the button has style with uh, uh, 18 pixel with a modern sorry Montserrat medium and the color is white so I'll give here select the button select the text sorry select the button and then select the fonts we're going Montserrat with a medium and then 16 uh, sorry 18 okay so it has the padding right and padding left about 30 so we have to select this into the 30 and we'll see on the padding top it's a uh, 12 it's a 12 okay and the color with a good radius is of uh, 0.4 so the radius value is a 4 with the background color like this okay and then we have to give the margin button a 50 cool now we are going to publish this website and see it on the live wow nice right okay wow <laughs> we got the button cta and then we got this design okay so if you see in the design this is the latest uh, section that we have to prepare this is the footer link that helps the user to find other stuff on our website so i think uh, i can easily to copy from this a uh, div so first of all i have to provide another a uh, section so we select this a uh, section and give the class name is a footer link okay so in this section we need a container and then we need the div okay so well actually i just simply to copy this a uh, div block and then i will simply to give into the container so the container has a div block okay so in this div block i uh, i got to uh, duplicate the class otherwise whenever i did changes so the design would wouldn't be uh good because okay so because it has the same name of the class so i will give the name footer wrapper right 
and then we select this uh, flex box on the left just like this and then we have well actually we have to put on the left right but how do we do that uh, let me think so it has to be on the left like this okay well actually uh, we have to see first the design is supposed to be like this okay so first of all I think I will simply to give the content first before I think about the style is so uh, in this landing I just simply to uh, double click and change into the 14 so in the main nav active we have to duplicate class which is footer link uh, footer link oh can't uh, item okay and then here we just give the style with a, a light with this color cb cb and cb okay and after that you select all of you select the second menu and you change the class into the uh, footer link item okay and then it has to be not pricing it has to be legal and it has to be uh, a jobs okay so in this jobs uh, okay sorry it has to be 14 okay legal jobs so in the jobs we have to give footer link item and after that we got privacy and policy privacy and policy okay and it has to be footer link item okay and we got for the last one we got a developer we got this a developer okay and now the question is how do we uh, make a space here it's pretty simple well actually you can easily to give the margin what everyone just like this wow simple right so if you see on the margin here they go a uh, 70 margin top so in this footer wrapper we don't have to define the hake but we have to define the a margin here a margin has to be a 70 all right some school so we are going publish to the selected domain and we have to preview again for the last time okay so this is so nice we did it we did it we did it uh, yeah so okay if you see in this adobe xd we got a lot of action here uh navigation cta and then the footer link but if you see uh, clearly the navigation has different size with this a uh, footer link so the reason why because i want to uh, make the user uh, that they're focusing on this main menu instead of this the additional menus okay and the cta has a different color with this logo because i want to make it a little bit bright because it can give at an attention in, into the user so they may be, uh, they're able to click this button and join the match okay so thank you very much well if you're enjoying this video tutorial please thumbs up and do not forget to share into your friends so if you're still interested just uh just let me know on the comment box because i'm going to think whether i'm continue about this webflow tutorial or not so thank you very much again and i'll see you in the next couple of days